above here, a uh, couple of words on the USDA report this morning. I uh, had the opportunity to take our guest onto the trading floor in the hopes of seeing some fireworks uh, resulting from the report and when it came out at 11 o'clock, uh, nothing happened. <laughs> Uh, I should have known better. This is one of those reports that is usually known for being a dud, and today was no exception. Um, the market reaction was muted. Corn and soybeans, as we speak, are up a little bit on a bearish report. Uh, a bigger corn carryout and a carryout in the soybeans that basically is unchanged and ignoring the better than expected exports that we've been seeing. So maybe we'll see a change in the January 12 report. I think we probably will. Um, on the week, it is my sad duty to report that meal, bean oil, corn, and soybeans are all well within last week's range. Uh, corn and soybeans especially spent the entire week just simply retracing all of last week's range. Uh, bean oil is down on the week, but well within uh, the previous week's range. Uh, meal is just marginally higher on the week, and it also uh, is not really doing much of anything. None of these markets are. And I think the bottom line, therefore, is until the January 12 report and for the next four weeks, we probably won't see much volatility in these markets uh, unless some uh, the fundamentals change dramatically uh, and so we'll keep an eye on that but until then this is Bub signing out see you